Ted Ginn Jr. Uh, with the Saints. Now, uh, if you remember, Saints had Cooks on to the Patriots. So you replaced, uh, what, a 23-year-old. Uh, you know, uh, with a 32-year-old. Did, listen, did the Saints win on that? Uh, Cooks has speed. Uh, but, you know, Saints got a first uh, round out of him when he was disgruntled. It was sort of the same kind of scenario that the Saints had with Percy Harvin. He might have had his moments in that Super Bowl with Seattle. But you traded a head case, you know, for a first round. Even as talented as he was, he was causing problems and always hurt. If he stayed with Minnesota for one more year... You know, uh, the Saints would have gotten nothing out of him. Instead, they got a guy like Xavier Rhodes. But, listen, on to the point of this video, Ted, uh, Ted Jin Jr. Um, with the Saints there, and I can't believe that the Dolphins took a kick return in the first round as he played with my team. I like Ted Jin. Okay, listen, I like him. But he thrived with Carolina for a reason, if not a few. The system worked in his favor, and Cam wasn't afraid to jam it to him at all. Look at his, look at his statistics outside of the Panthers. Nothing to write home about. With all that said, being that he did play for my team, I do hope he has success. But I don't see him doing anything better than any of his years with Carolina. Now, you're going to tell me Drew Brees has made wide receiver one and twos out of guys like David Patton, Lance Moore, Henderson, Marquise uh, Colston. You're sure that he might be getting some numbers. I don't know, man. I just see it. If I were a Saint fan, it's going to be heartbreaking when you hear or see... Ted Ginn Jr. Wide open down the field. Drew Brees hits him in stride. And oh no, it's dropped. Hope all is well.